hi welcome again here we have a little scene uh, created using the landmass plugin and also with the ocean comes with the 4.26 water system and we use the open land as the material the landscape material and i'm going to show you how to create how to paint like this like have this beach like surface under the water and also have a fully rock uh, surface on this rock and remove grass from the bottom of the water and also remove grass from all over this rock right uh, so let's get started this is how it looks like without any custom painting so let me put sun in a known position so we can uh, inspect everything uh, visually clearly so we have a rock material here so basically we use this rock using the landmass plugin and you can see uh, it it actually paint grass all over the rock and we don't really need that we need the, the rock to be whole rock without any grass and also let's go to the ocean so let's put the player so you can see there's no beach actually everything is uh, the auto material basically the ground and also under the water we can see uh, grass maybe this is something you want but in this case i, I won't have a beach uh, like surface so basically everything should be sand and also yep so the rock should be fully rock material first let's open our landscape material here i'm using open land but this method will work with any kind of landscape material so all right let's open the landscape tools mods landscape here we are going to use alpha layers the reason is landmass plugin which is the one uses the water plugin as well doesn't work really with normal made blended layers so we need to create alpha layers uh, luckily open land comes with a set of alpha layers here i'm going to focus on three layers sand which is gonna use for the uh, beach and i have selected the layer info which is quite important you need to select the layer info first otherwise uh, the painting won't work and also we the rock material is available in the slope alpha and we're gonna use that and also we have a remove grass layer so basically if you paint something uh, with this remove grass layer it will actually remove the grass here we also use alpha layer otherwise it won't work now i'm gonna select my rock so you can easily select it from the world outline i have renamed that so it's quite easy to select and then in the details panel search under the brush settings and paint layers all right and then i'm gonna add a new one so here see so now we have grass over the top of the sur top surface all right and then i'm gonna add my layer here so it should be it should be slope alpha in in my case so basically it actually removed the ground surface on the top of my material top of my rock but it doesn't remove the grass that's totally fine so what i can do is actually i need to remove uh, the ground material from these places as well so what i can do is i can uh, expand this uh, this paint layer and i'm gonna increase this edge offset value right uh, let's put something like thousand basically remove the all, all the the ground surface from here I'll, I'll go a little bit further here we can see some ground surface right uh, let's uh, increase this something around thousand and five hundred all right now you can see it actually expand my materiality into places like this as well and this is totally fine all right i like it so now so I'm, i need to remove the grass as well so it's quite easy i'm gonna create a new paint layer on the rock and here i'm gonna type remove grass so that's my uh, paint layer for removing grass in this landscape material so let's uh, wait until it compiles everything all right we cannot see grass on this area but we can still see here that's because it doesn't apply for everything so we can simply increase our edge offset i'm gonna type something around thousand right now you can see it remove grass over here i think uh, i'm gonna go a little bit further like thousand and hundred maybe right so yeah yeah we can change it later on all right now I'm, i need to have some sort of sand layer here on the bottom of the rock so let's do that as well so i'm going to create a new layer called let's put it as sand alpha so because that's my sand layer you can see it apply on the top of my here surface but i, I don't want that so what i can do is i'm going to click these uh mask using the band option all right now it, it acts as a band like a like a ribbon 
uh, so I can easily uh, move, move here and there. For example, the here the width is something around 512. So and we can use the edge offset to go down. For example, let's type 1000. So now it actually go to the bottom of my rock. I think I'll go for something around 1200. All right. Then I'm going to reduce the fall off width to something around like maybe 100. Maybe it's too little. Let's put it something around 200. All right. So basically you can play with these numbers and, and try to get a look that you are going for. Now we have completed our rock. All right, let's go to the ocean. So now we can see we have this grass under the water and we don't really need that. We need to have a beach. Uh, we're gonna first go to the landscape water brush manager. This is quite important. We need to go here. And here under the details panel, go to the settings section and try to select this effect weight map section. Otherwise, the changes we are going to do is not gonna happen. So basically it tells to change the weight map, basically the paint layers of the landscape. Otherwise, yeah, it, it won't work. Then I'm gonna select my water body. And here we have a section under the terrain uh, layer weight map settings. That's what we need to focus on. So here I'm gonna select this plus icon again and here I'm gonna type my sand alpha because that's my sand layer. You can see now it actually changed the sand behind here. Okay, that's that's pretty neat. That's what I want. Then I'm gonna create a new layer. So basically I'm gonna add remove grass. All right, now it remove grass from here as well. So now we can see we don't see any grass under the surface, under the water, and also we have a beach without any grass. And uh, we have very interesting controls over here. For example, in the remove grass, sure, we can add a noise texture and try to tile grass using that. For example, I have a grunge material, grunge noise here. So you can use any sort of noise, okay? And then I'm gonna start tiling. And that actually affect how we are using the grass and uh, influence yeah so basically you can uh, add a noise texture and trying to control grass how it actually uh, painted over the place basically i need to put some grass over the sand surface as well that's why i did it right and i think the that's all we have uh, ocean with beach with a beach and we don't have anything under the surface and also we have a rock and we manually painted that uh, to have the slope material, basically rock material, and also remove grass, and we did some uh, painting over here. Right, uh, this is pretty exciting. I hope you enjoy the content. Um, yeah, see you soon with something interesting. Bye.